Apple's libraries are your natural ally with the First Amendment. I sure didn't feel that way in 2016 when they ejected me from the anti-Trump event and called the police on me. This Ridley-O is brought to you by LRN.FM. Feds don't want you to hear them. So, uh, my question that you're not trying to uh, Do you help make policy for the library? Um, yes. Do you have anything to do with this policy that says you got to have permission to film? It was discussed at our leadership team before it goes to the board with our recommendation. It's a do you support uh, making people like me get permission to film civic meetings like this. Well, whatever the policy is, I'm not supportive because I would have been looking for the library if it wasn't. Did you know I have had the police called on me twice for doing this? By your people. Um, if I'm not, if I remember correctly, I think there was a, one of the security officers who had the policy to you, from what I could tell, etc. So, um, I'll just leave it at that. All right. So the communications officer didn't talk to you? Oh, I got talked to by a lot of people. <laughs> All right. I appreciate the answers. And he is one of the people behind this. So this has been going on for 11 years. We've been sponsoring for two. Sorry, what? At 4, there's going to be a setup for a reception in here. So it's open use for now, but at 4 o'clock, it's the next group. So. That's not a source of controversy for me. No, okay. Yeah. Just want to let you know, you can use the room until four. All right, I appreciate that. <clears throat> so the same thing, I can get, get home without uh, the police stopping or shooting up. You know, you went from a persona non grata to come on in and take pictures. <laughs> so what exactly happened? Did they send out a mass mail or something that I was here? <laughs> no, no, I, I just saw you out there listening to the, no, you don't. I just saw you out there. Oh, come on. That's technically assault, you know. Uh, which one? <laughs> that is, too. That's an invasion of privacy. I think so, huh? Oh, be there as a kid. You take care. All right. <laughs> Without you hiding behind the camera for one second. No. Okay. <clears throat> You're a government is... guy. Okay. Um, sometime I would love to have an opportunity to talk to you because libraries are your natural ally with the First Amendment. Uh, I sure didn't feel that way in 2016 when they ejected me from the anti-Trump event and called the police on me and they showed up. I know, sir. Yeah. But sometime, if you'd ever like to have a conversation with me as a person instead of a target. I would welcome that. I appreciate I that. Think many librarians would. Yeah, I, I see the point. Then, uh, then yeah. try it sometime. Yeah, sometime reach out to me. As government a officials on the job. Let's have, a, let's have a conversation. Government officials need to be on the record pretty much at all times. Thank you, sir. If you'd ever like to have a real conversation with me, I'd welcome it. I consider this real, but I do appreciate the offer. Best wishes. Sorry, sir. Best wishes. What do you think libraries stand for? Well, they're a government expense to me, yes. first and foremost. Yes. After that, they sometimes do heroic things. Okay. Do you ever want to see us as we are? Is that not how you are? When you have the camera pointed in your face, sir, that's not natural for many people. And I know it might be for you, but it's hard to have a real conversation with someone who's holding a camera at all times. I talk to many people every day. You're the only one that insists on doing this. If you want to talk about the First Amendment, if you want to talk about what libraries mean, if you want to talk about any of that, I'll have the conversation with the camera. But if you want to have a more natural conversation, 
I'd ask for that, and I'd ask you to show me that respect. I, I may be the only one, but every species needs one. Maybe not more than one. <clears throat> I wish you well. All At right. The same time, I hope that you give us the chance to actually talk. I appreciate that. Do that. Federal agents on the streets of Keene, New Hampshire. They're investigating reports of an unlicensed radio station said to be broadcasting LRN.FM. So why all the fuss? What is LRN.FM? Well, it's probably not something these agents want you to listen to. It's a 24-hour news talk broadcast, all pro-liberty. A true authoritarian free zone. Tune in at LRN.FM to listen or broadcast their signal. LRN.FM, Feds don't want you to hear them.